Now well, that's St Fillin's today and that is situated in the far western corner of Strathern. We're going to have a walk in the Glentarkin Woods and also along the goat's path and that's named after the wild goats that once grazed the pastures. Also going to have a walk along the disused railway line. Now this line was opened on the 1st of October 1901 but unfortunately it was never profitable and it was officially closed exactly 50 years later on the 1st of October 1951 although the track remained until 1959 as the line was used occasionally throughout the 1950s to transport materials to the hydroelectric construction sites in the area. So we're just having a wee look at the top of the bridge and looking over at the old line here. You can just see um, Lochern in the background there. See Corey having a wee drink. You'll find Corey's in the majority of my videos, you've probably noticed. The plaque tells you that the wooden bridge we've just walked over, it was built by the Royal Engineer Reservist in 1996. Now looking over to Loch Ern, it's a freshwater loch and it's six and a half miles long. This loch is stocked regularly with brown and rainbow trout and fishing by permit is possible from the shore and by boat. Now Loch Ern, it's unusual in that it has its own apparent tidal system. This is caused by the action of the prevailing wind blowing along the loch. Just taking a minute or two's rest here just to admire the view and take another photo before we get going on the journey again. This is really a, a lovely walk, but it really is very muddy in places. We've had to walk right at the edge of the path to avoid getting filthy.
That's the end of the walk. Keep watching our videos. You never know where we'll end up next. Bye for now.